Welcome wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station. And we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. On the Metropolitano here in Madrid, one of European football's newest landmarks. Watching game this between two very high quality sides, a treat for everybody here. Oh, get ready for some high grade football, Peter. Two strong teams, as you say, full of wonderful individual talent. And we have every right to anticipate some really entertaining football. As to whether we'll see a high-scoring contest, that's a little harder to predict. I'm not complaining, though, because there are good players everywhere you look around this surface, and that's a fine start in itself. And we're underway. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Yeah, Jan Oblak. He's not someone you often see pulling off spectacular saves, but that's about the highest compliment you can give a goalkeeper because it speaks to his positioning and his organisational abilities. He's just about the best there is when it comes to, to claiming crosses and high balls into the box too. And he's just the kind of presence that spreads a, a composure and a confidence to his defence and throughout the team. Yeah, I'd have picked him to no doubt the fans feel much the same way. Llorente. Memphis to tie. Referee has just said play on. Tries to get it forward quickly. Saul. Atletico Madrid are uh, seeing a lot of the ball early on, but can they make it tell? It's not the game we were hoping for, Peter. I think both of these keepers could text about their respective involvement. Okay. Saul plays it out to the wing. It's a fine run and he's happy to keep going. Well, that's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. He's away! Lewandowski plays it out to the flank. Cut out in the nick of time. Beautiful, intricate passing. They are toying with their opponents. Well, they know that their version of what they do is extremely good. I mean, it's a level of possession that leaves the opposition chasing shadows. Forward it goes. Uh, the ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. The one Llorente Lewandowski Lewandowski unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. Llorente on a strong run, he's not played the ball, that's a foul. Can't say now that he hasn't been warned. Well, I think the referee would have told him to rein it in or, or suffer the consequences. And it's Saul. A 
And here's Morata. Looking for space out wide. Chance! There it is! And always such a great time to score. A brilliant boost before you head in for half-time. And you can guarantee that dressing room will be buzzing now. Simple finish in the end. What do you think, Jim? Yeah, it looks simple, Peter, but it requires intelligent use of space and, and good understanding to pull it off. Atletico Madrid break the deadlock. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. He's coming on the right now. What's on? Oh, it's taken out. That'll be a foul. There could be trouble here. But for now, the referee is keeping his cards in his pocket. Well, by crossing the ball so quickly, I think this defence just can't get set to deal with it. I think deserved a better outcome than what we saw, but um, worth exploring more. And he's made sure that that won't get through. And the half-time whistle goes. So there you have it, a close sport half of football, but that has still had its moments, and ultimately produced just one goal. A decent game up to Views on the first half. Atletico Madrid clearly are benefiting from their homework. They've dealt with anything that's been thrown at them and have been smart on the break. Atletico Madrid having to have the lead in a tight old game. Half time, 1 0. So we're already into the second period. Atletico Madrid carrying a one goal lead. Played into the middle. Strong punch. Gundogan. Llorente. Good ball. Now it's Koke. Gets away from his opponent. Koke! And that would have been some goal. Well, the run was really impressive. The finish was depressive, and expectations were not met. It's all a little short of forward momentum, lacking thrust. Gundogan. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Atletico Madrid are ahead here by what is still the only goal. And it's Cancelo. Keeps everyone guessing. Chooses to go back. Oh, that's nice. He's been bundled over. That is a foul. Oh, good ball. This is exactly the approach they have to take now, Peter. 
Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Just has to be done. Gets good distance on it. Just brushed off the ball there. Fence has got rid of that. Gundogan. Lewandowski. Sergio, what are you thinking? Well, while the temptation's always there, Peter, I think it would be ill-advised of them to try settle for what they've got. Raspilicueta. Llorente. Going through. Danger averted for now. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. And it's played forward. Barcelona are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Keeper's got good distance on that. This is gone, that's a foul. He knew what was coming, that's a yellow card. And the players are flocking round their fallen colleague and they look worried. Atletico Madrid making consecutive changes here. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honest shift. <laughs> Barcelona need to give it everything they have, kitchen sink included. He's looked long this time. Played back in. Correa. And he's there to cut it out. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. It's a loose ball. And that's that. Atletico Madrid headed by the only goal. Result, no question, the most important thing, however it came. Final score, 1-0. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Well, Peter, I'm sure a more comfortable margin would have been preferable, but you can't expect to get your way all the time. I think it was a win earned through game management, and there's absolutely...